The White House said today the president's invitation to Vladimir Putin for a Washington meeting is on hold until the special counsel wraps up his investigation into Russian interference in the 2016 election. Regarding the conversation between the two presidents in Helsinki, Nancy Cordes reports tonight senators pressed the Secretary of State for details. Are you 100 percent confident that you know everything that President Trump discussed with President Putin. I'm very confident that I received a comprehensive debriefing from President Trump. Several senators tried. It's not for me to disclose the contents of those conversations. But Secretary of State Mike Pompeo would not give them any new details about the president's controversial meeting with Putin. Did he tell you what, whether or not uh, what happened in those two hours? Yes, Senator, the predicate of your question implied some notion that there was something improper about having a one-on-one -on -one meeting. I completely disagree. New question. Jersey Democrat Bob Menendez wanted to know if the president promised to weaken sanctions. Senator, the president was very clear with Vladimir Putin about U.S. positions. And that he told you that. Senator, I understand the game that you're playing. No, no, it. you know, Mr. Secretary, I, I do. I, I with it. all due respect, yeah, I don't I appreciate it. you c characterizing my questions. My questions is to get to the truth. We That's don't right. know what the truth is. You do. And the, the committee's chair, yes, Republican well, Bob Corker, well, said the questions reflect a broader concern. But it's the president's actions that create tremendous distrust in our nation, among our allies. Senator, I, I just I disagree with most of what you just said there. The, every sanction that was put in place was signed off by the president of the United States. Every spy that was removed was well, directed we'll by go the to, president. Go to the point that I Somehow did. there's this idea that this administration is free-floating. This is President Trump's administration. Make no mistake who's fully in charge of this. Yeah. The skepticism extended to U.S. policy on North Korea, where the ruling party reportedly vowed today not to give up its nuclear weapons despite U.S. overtures. Secretary Pompeo insisted that nuclear talks are making concrete progress, though he declined, Jeff, to share any specifics. Nancy Cordes, thank you very much.